It's your boy, Big Kelv, repping that seven day genetics. You know how I do it. I work out seven days. Seven days. But anyways, back to my segment, which I call Fuck Outta Here, in which I talk about things that bother me, typically gym related, but occasionally, I go off the cuff and it's not related to the gym. Today is going to be a bit of an off the cuff day. Um, this is something that really gets to me, and I know I say it a lot. And people are like, yeah, Kelvin, a lot of things get to you, and they do. But what I want to talk about are negative people. I can't stand negative people. And I know a lot of you have watched my videos and you've said to yourself, but Kelvin, you're negative. Bitch, I'm not negative. I'm just telling you things I don't like. That doesn't make me negative. But when I talk about negativity, what I'm more talking about are people trying to tell you what you can and cannot do simply because they can't do it. Now, people will often tell you how you should take this huge dream you have and shrink it down to more pal palatable pieces so that you can achieve it. But who are they to tell you what you can or cannot do? Simply because it hasn't worked for them or chances are they probably haven't even tried. They just want to tell you how to compartmentalize your goals so that you achieve them like, like in Pac-Man, you know, he, he chews the pellets piece by piece. Well, they want you to bite one small pellet at a time. Shoot, maybe you don't want to be like that. Maybe you want to do, you know, every every bite is a power up. That's it. Every bite is a major move instead of little tiny moves. Every bite for you is a major step. And for them, it's slow. Because they're slow motion. And you're not. You don't have to move to their pace. You don't have to bounce to their beat. Who are they in your life to tell you how to handle your life? Let me tell you, there's too many people out here with too much money and they didn't bounce to anyone's beat. You know why? Because they were captains of their own ship. They made a decision on their own and they stuck to it. They didn't let the naysayers tell them what they could or could not do. Stop trying to tell people how to live their life. You are not them. Allow them to live it the way that they see fit. Because if they fail, but they put their heart into it, then they know for a fact they did everything to achieve that dream the way they wanted to. But if they do it your way and they fail, then shit, they just wasted time. If you're someone who's getting advice from others and you're following that advice, you're a fool. This life is yours to live and yours to live alone. You go out there and you get it the best way you feel like you need to get it and stop listening to others. People can give you pointers, but they can't tell you how to live your life. What next? They're going to be telling you how to satisfy your woman? Ladies, they're going to tell you how to satisfy your man. Please, you better get your life together or the next person going to slide up and get out of here, man. And the reason I bring this up is because I'm going to bring it back to the gym a little bit. I was at the gym today and this dude going to tell this other dude um, essentially that he won't be able to pack on a certain amount of weight because he couldn't. What? Dude. Your genetics and my genetics are two different things. Don't tell me I can't do something just because you couldn't do it, you bitch. I just wanted to go up to that dude and talk to the little younger dude because the one he was telling that to was a little bit younger. I said, yo, I hear he's trying to give you some pointers, but hold up, let me tell him something. Fuck out of here. How you gonna tell this man how his genetics are going to work? You can't. Now, I understand you can be logical and say, okay, you're not going to build 50 pounds of muscle in, let's say, a year, naturally. 
He's just not going to do it. Okay, I get that. But don't try to shoot down his dreams, man. I feel like today, that's all we do is shoot down other people's dreams to feed our own egos. Me, these days, somebody say they want to do something, I'd be like, then do it then. But if they ask me my opinion, okay, I'm going to give my opinion, but I'm not going to try to shoot down what they think they want to do. But anyways, it's your boy, Big Kelf. If you like what you've heard, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. If you don't want to subscribe, that's cool. Also, just go ahead and watch my damn videos. Trust me, I love that. If you have an idea for an upcoming video, go ahead and put it down in the comments. And if I agree, and it's something that bothers me also, I'll go ahead and make a video about it. If I don't, then I won't. Start your own channel. Do your own thing. But that's not me saying that I don't appreciate the comments. That's not me saying that I don't appreciate you watching my videos. It's just simply saying I got to be passionate about a thing in order to make a video about it. That's all. Anyways, it's your boy, Big Kel. As usual, just want to say to y'all, see you tomorrow. Peace.